Iowa lawmakers are pushing for more regulation on what they view as drug paraphernalia. That includes glass pipes. But Iowans who sell those pipes say lawmakers misunderstand the industry. Local 5's Lakin McGee has more on how a local tobacco shop could be impacted with proposed legislation. Uncle Ruckuses say it's going to cause more damage to their customers because prices will soon skyrocket. I brought you this story in March, and in the past 24 hours, the House has decided to reevaluate the bill. Good to go, man. Right, right, right. As yeah. customers buy products from Uncle Ruckuses, the owner of the smoking and skate shop, Zarin Horton, wants Iowa senators to know the bill stereotypes smoke shops like his, saying you can't use the glassware to smoke the combustion tobacco, hemp, and other plant materials that are noted in the bill. You can't market all of us in the same category. Horton says on top of that, the bill forces the retailer to renew a permit every year in order to sell. That costs $1,500. And if they want to mail their products to customers, that's another annual permit also for $1,500. And customers aren't happy. You can't funnel everybody under one bill because some people want to ruin it for the rest of us. 3,500 people signed a petition to stop the bill from passing. Maybe only 3,500 people signed it, but I think the voices of those 3,500 reached quite a bit, you know, farther than we expected it to. The Senate approved an excess tax of 40% for devices like glass pipes. That's a tax the supplier, like Uncle Ruckus, has to pay. And that gets passed on to the consumer and the product price. The House lawmakers filed and passed an amendment to lower that tax to 20%. We're obviously not going to be able to eat the full tax on the backside, so we're going to have to pass at least a portion of that, if not all of it, back onto the to the consumer. I spoke with Representative Carter Nordman. Now he says that the bill could be voted on in the next week. I also reached out to Senator Dawson. He initiated the bill, but we didn't hear back from him for comment. I'm Lakin McGee for Local 5 News. We are Iowa. The bill also mentions the glassware cannot be seen by anyone younger than 21, so anyone selling this glassware will have to find a way to accommodate that.